What's up, what's good? Hey, it's your girl, Kayda Janae, and we are back with another video. For starters, I just want to thank you guys for clicking this video and giving it a watch. I always appreciate all the love as I film this. We have already hit 600 subscribers, and I just hope that we can continue to grow, and I just thank all of you every day for keeping up with Kay and wanting to see what I'm up to, what I'm buying, where I've been, where I'm going. You feel me? And... I know I don't post on here as often and I will I promise you I will but in the meantime make sure that you are keeping up with me and following all of my social media which is linked down below so you don't miss anything you don't miss what I'm doing where I'm at where I'm going and you're just in the know without further ado let's get into what today's video is going to be about as you can tell by the title this is really my like first unboxing video so I'm really going on a whim here I'm riffing it um I stole that word from on my block I don't even know what riffing means or how to use the term but that's what I'm doing I'm riffing um and you guys are riffing with me uh this is my first unboxing video I received my Telfar duffel in the mail about two or three days ago and it's just been sitting in the box now when I got it in this big cardboard box, I was like, did I order more stuff? And cause I have been ordering a lot of things lately. So like a lot of things have been getting delivered and I'm like, is this something that I missed that I needed? I'm like what the hell is this? I was like, you know what? Let me open it. Open it and I saw the big Telfar sign and I closed the box right away. I closed the box right away and I put it to the side. I said, I'm gonna wait until I have some time to film this video because I want to get my full reaction like my first impression completely of when I open this bag so this is it and I'm really excited because I had no idea that this was going to ship so quickly because I really just ordered it like maybe maybe two weeks ago maybe a week and a half ago I just ordered it and it's here let's get into it but we're going to start off on how hard it was to get this bag so Y'all know that Telfar has just released Telfar TV. Now Telfar TV is his streaming platform that's meant to be kind of like Apple TV and whatever the case may be. So that's what Telfar TV is. It's his own channel, basically his own streaming network. Now this network is available on Apple TV, but y'all it's not available on the Apple TV app like I thought it was it's available on the actual Apple TV so if you have Apple TV then you can go download the Telfar TV app you get what I'm saying so if you have Roku you can go do the same thing I got a fire stick it's not available on fire stick yet so you know what I had to do I had to go on the Telfar TV website which is available for everybody to watch now the only thing with going on the Telfar TV website is when that QR code comes up which is called a drip when that drip comes up for you to scan that QR code with your phone so that you can purchase your duffel if you watch the Telfar TV on your phone how are you gonna scan the QR code at this point I'm like how the hell am I gonna get this bag what am I gonna do so while I'm home I had it pulled up on my little MacBook I'm laying in the bed watching Netflix as usual but best believe Telfar TV was pulled up on that MacBook so when that drip came your girl was drip ready while I was at work with the iPads I had the iPad going on Safari on TelfarTV.net walk around with the iPad in my hand doing you know regular managerial duties meanwhile nobody knew I was trying to cop this bag nobody at work knew that I was trying to cop this bag I'm going through all of the stress of trying to get it one day when I was at work the drip alert came like and I heard it it's just started like alarming and I'm like oh my god like literally y'all when I tell y'all I got so anxious my hands we're shaking. I have the iPad in my hand shaking. I took my phone and I'm like trying to scan it to, to, to process the order. And I think the first one that came up for me was the large. 
So I had no idea what size I wanted. I just knew I had to have one of these bags. So I I put the large in my cart and I'm like, hey, do you really want the large? The large is uh, $490, by the way. The large is $490, the medium is $390, and the small is $290. So it's a much higher price point than it is when you get to the shopping bags. So I'm like, bro, what size do I want? Do I want a large? If I get the large, this will be great to travel with. I had it in my cart and I hesitated. Although it's in my cart, that hesitation moment is what made me lose out on that bag. I was like, you know what, Kay? All right, cool. We're going to be prepared for the next trip. We're going to be prepared. Let's see if there's pictures of what sizes are available so you can know what size you want. And I know that there are multiple colors. So I'm like, do I want the black and the large? Do I want it in another color? Like, what do I want? It was very, 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 very stressful. Now, the way these trips work is they are only dropping the amount of bags of the amount of people watching. So if I hesitate for one moment, it's gone. It's sold out, boo hoo, my feelings are hurt. That day goes by, I come home, pull it up on my laptop, have it loaded on my laptop, fall asleep while it's loaded on my laptop. This is the day I had a nail appointment to get my nails done. Shout out to my nail tech, Nails by Van 90, um, 97. So I had woke up early, my body just woke me up out of nowhere and I couldn't go back to sleep. So I was just up waiting for time to go by for me to go to my nail appointment. I moved my laptop from beside me to right in front of me. So I'm laying in bed, my laptop is like laying in my lap, I'm just like scrolling on my phone, doing my daily you know, social media scroll after you wake up in the morning. No, it, it, it just starts going off. My heart starts racing. I'm like, this is it. This is the moment. I gotta get it. It comes up, QR code. The QR code showed all three sizes. Small, medium, large, all in black. I scanned it, I said, K, pick one, don't waste no time. If you waste some time, you're not getting this damn bag. Cause I cannot be waiting, trying to look at Tofar TV all damn day every day it's stressful it is very very stressful and I scanned it and I was like you know what boom we get in a medium I, why did I pick the medium I don't know I have a medium black shopper that is my everyday bag like literally I carry a medium black shopper everywhere I go you see me in Walmart K got her shopper you see me at the gas station K got her black shopper like and that's the only top car bag that I have like I want to get other colors, of course, but it's so stressful. Y'all know how stressful these ter Telfar drops are, so I'm not even going to get into it. Added the bag into my cart, put in all the information, verified that I wasn't like uh, a robot, but since I had previously tried to get the large, it had already shaved my saved, not shaved, it had already saved my shipping information, so it was less for me to type. So I was like, there we go. We're on the roll. We're this close. We're this close. Put in everything, and I click submit order. And I was like, please don't, don't please don't let me hit submit, and it tell me like it's out of stock. I click submit. It said thank you. I said I got it. Like I got it. And and the first thing I could think of was like, bruh, I really got a black shopper. Like I'm in shock. I'm so so happy. And it came in the mail, and I'm super excited to unbox this with all of you. Okay, guys, so this is the box that came in the mail. Big, big, big black box. Not black, big brown box. All the stuff is here. Now, the, the thing said from really right on LLC, so I'm like, what the hell is that? Like, is that, like, when you order, if you've ordered stuff from Shein before, I'm pretty sure Shein starts with an R too because it doesn't say Shein on the packaging. So I'm like, what the hell is this? I'm like, I don't know what this is. So boom, your girl had to figure out how to open it because I couldn't figure it out and then I realized it had this little thing right here, so I did that. Oh, let's, let's do this together. Oh. Straight to it. Nothing more, nothing less. This is it, you guys. So. I kind 
to just knock some things over, but that's okay. We ain't going to get into that. Uh, my little packaging slip right here. Medium Telfar duffel, black, $390. So, if you've ordered a Telfar bag before, you already know how they come. They come in the clear packaging, and then it comes in your bag. This is actually, like, holding it like this, this is actually a pretty good size for a medium. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm such, I'm such a joke. Unzip this. Let me turn it this way. All right, there we go, baby. Look at that. It just smells. It smells new. It smells clean. This has um two little long wax strings here that I can go ahead and open. What's this? Oh, that's just that's just cardboard. I don't I don't need that. Let's take out this this other one. I don't need that either. All right, you guys, the moment of truth. Oh, look at this beauty. Let's take that off too. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is so freaking. Gorgeous. So it's basically plain all in the front and all on the back. And then on the sides is where you have your your Telfar sign. So does this open? Oh look, you got your little Telfar, your Telfar zipper. It's the details for me. It is the details for me that are on both sides. And then at the top, you have a zipper in the middle as well. Honestly, I feel like this is a good size for a medium. Now, the large is a large. The large is like carry-on size. So, I do want a large, but just in a different um, color. So, I'm just going to take this off. Okay, so we got all of the plastic goodness off. So these are your regular straps, your regular holding straps. So this is for if you want to do a little over the shoulder. Like over the shoulder, this is, I would say, this is an okay length. Um, I'm going to just, oh shit. Over the shoulder is an okay length. It's giving like... I just don't really like how close it is under my arm, but of course, you could always hold it like this as well. Now, I'm going to open it because I'm sure it also comes with another strap. All this stuffing. I hope these papers are um, recycled. But I'm definitely, if they aren't recycled, I'm definitely putting them in my recycling bin so it can go back to the earth. Because, good child. Okay, so now the inside, it doesn't offer as much room as a medium shopper would. Because this doesn't open too much. It's not a wide opening. Um, but you could hold a lot in here. I feel like. Like, I can hold my agenda, I can hold a water bottle, I can hold my big-ass phone because I do have a 13 Pro Max. Um, so, that can go in here. I feel like if I were to get a small shot, uh, a small stuff on my 13 Pro Max, probably wouldn't even fit in there. Um, so, you could hold a nice amount in here. The only thing is, um, I do have a organizer in my medium shopper. I would love to have an organizer for something like this, too, but... You know how people say that the shoppers are like they people say the shoppers are flimsy or whatever the case may be they don't uphold well but you guys have to understand that one this is a luxury that is affordable it's not gonna stand up straight it's not a stiff bag one this is i'm pretty sure these bags are vegan leather correct me if i'm wrong so they are very like 
body friendly but i can see that i feel that the shape of this bag isn't gonna lose like it's not like gonna be like this you know it's gonna hold i feel like this is a little bit more sturdier than the shoppers are it does of course have this strap here that came attached with it that you can use if you want to carry your shopper crossbody now look at the de I just like kind of lost track because the details in this it even has Telfar engraved into this here I hope y'all can see that but this is just your strap this is not an adjustable strap it's just one long strap that's it that's all um you know it probably could have or should have been adjustable um for those taller people or people you know who just like to have that option to adjust so you just hook it straight on and boom so you have your hooked strap and your hand straps um I do when it comes to bags like this I do like versatility like being able to tuck these outside straps in or remove them or take them off some way but that's completely fine so the inside does also have a, a zippered pocket so that you can hold like all of your smaller belongings so I'm gonna try to show y'all but so it's a zippered pocket here and it opens just like that and zips back all of the zippers on this bag does have the telfot logo which i've noticed like that is the um the details are very specific on this bag as opposed to the shoppers it's not as much details on there when it comes to everything but this is really nice and let's see how much space we have here in the side i wouldn't really hold anything here in the side other than like air pods or something like that like it's really just like what else am i supposed to put right here i would just put my airpods for easy access or maybe like keys i don't even know if i would want to put my keys in this outside pocket so there y'all have it this is the medium black Telfar duffel. I'm actually very, very excited about this purchase. I think what I'm gonna do is get um, a large one in color or white maybe um, and get it personalized to my liking by you know a black creator who does like artwork and things like that so that I could travel with it. I know that's mine. And then I'll get smaller ones in different colors. I definitely am super, super happy with this purchase. Um, 390, am I gonna say it's worth 390? I don't know, I ain't paid for it. <laughs> so, um, you have that. So if I had paid for it, maybe I would feel a different type of way, but I mean, it's so far, it's black luxury, it's affordable and this is something to have like not everybody is gonna have one of these bags just because of how hard it is to obtain so now i just feel like if i have one then i am like and i don't want to say like upper echelon but like bitch i got it like do you have one do you have one like and I could, like she'll just sit so nicely next to my black shopper like I just now I just want to get all the color this is really nice though so I would assume the small is like this freaking big and the large is huge like I've seen a picture of the large the large is huge but I really really do like this this looks very elegant like it feels very nice like this leather I don't know it feels nicer than the shopper leather I can definitely say that um the only thing I would say I wish this bag came with was an adjustable strap because it's really just the strap so that is pretty much it with this so far I rate you I ain't gonna say 10 because I feel like that's just like not honest I'm gonna say an 8 I say an 8 out of 10 um, for now 
maybe once I get it in another color or I get a large one, I'll I'll give you more props. Um, cause I don't know what I can put in this yet. Once I figure it out, do y'all want to see what do I uh, what do I keep in my duffel bag? I'm, this is definitely not gonna become my everyday bag. This is gonna be an outfit bag. Like, wait till I dress this up and wear this somewhere tight. You know what I'm saying? Cause my black telfar is my everyday bag. But would y'all like to see what's in my duffel when I do wear this? Maybe maybe it's something y'all would like to see. Just comment down below and let me know. I can't even stop showing y'all. It's, it's just so it's it's pretty to look at, and it sits perfectly with the shop with the um the shopper at least with mine. Like if I were to sit it somewhere, it's gonna like lean over like this. I didn't mean to do that. It was sitting in my hand, but it's gonna lean over and fall basically like what that just did. But I can tell I can sit this somewhere and it's gonna stay. I can tell that it's very sturdy, so so far you get a lot of points for that. Uh, but definitely let me know what you guys think of this bag. Do you want to see more unboxing videos from me? How was this one for my first unboxing? Like, I don't really know what more else to say than, other than pull the thing out the bag, show y'all how it looks, tell y'all what I think, and put it back. Like, ain't that how unboxing videos supposed to go? But hey. That's that. I hope you guys can get your hands on a Telfar duffel. I definitely want more colors and I hope that I can get my hands on more as well. Definitely comment down below and let me know what you guys think. Shout out to you, Telfar, for dropping yet another banger. Like something that people want, something that people are like dying to have. So we, as part of the black community and you being a black luxury designer, I appreciate you speaking for everybody else we appreciate you thank you thank you thank you so much all right guys so that is it thank you so much for watching this unboxing definitely comment down below and let me know what you think don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not subscribed already like what are you doing there's definitely more to come share this video with your friends i appreciate all of you guys for keeping up with k and i hope that you continue to do so by following me on all of my social media that is down below at k Dejanay. until next time keep up and i will see y'all in my next video bye